Hello everyone. My name is Amit and I am Megha and we are celebrating Global Water Colour Day today and also the 11th anniversary of International Water Colour Society. Water colour is the most traditional medium and we have been working with water colour since the ancient times. So, today the whole world is celebrating water colour with us. Okay, so let's meet today uh, our president and founder Mr. Atta Mutovar. Hello everyone, so uh, this is me Megha Kapoor and uh, I am Amit Kapoor and uh, we are celebrating Global Water Colour Day on 23rd of January. So this wonderful idea actually came from uh, our president and founder of uh, International Water Colour Society Globe, Mr. Atanu Dogun. So I would like to, uh, you know, introduce him to all of you and he's a wonderful uh, great person who has founded this uh, huge society huge network so we welcome you mr atanur and uh, please explain all of us that how this idea of celebrating global water color day came to your mind yeah over to you thank you very much this is actually uh, an idea came from me but this network came from you because of <laughs> you believing in this network, you believing in this society and all your efforts, yours and our other uh, colleagues, all our leaders around the world. They are collective uh, efforts. Bring these days watercolor, one of the uh, most, uh, you know, powerful technique and recognizable uh, technique around the world. You know, we start Watercolor Society almost 11 years ago. Yeah. You know, because of uh, we are watercolorists, all our life income came from our watercolor painting, professionally paint all uh, over uh, 35 years. And mm. finally, we, we decided to make this uh, important technique work uh, oldest and most difficult, challenging watercolor technique. Hmm. Also uh, recognizable in school, in museum, in co in collection. So that reason we, we start making uh, artists together and celebrating peace and harmony and cultural exchange with festivals and exhibitions and. Uh, BNL, all kind of watercolor activities around the world. Yes. Since then, this is 11th years past. Yeah. True. Yes. And also, we are we are also celebrating, celebrating our 11th IWS 11th anniversary. Yes. Congratulations. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Arun. This is this is the idea. You know, we, uh, making one important global watercolor day it should be right time right reason and right power for taking care for next generation yeah. you know, it was in my mind many years and i was following all different announcements about the watercolor day watercolor uh, week watercolor uh, month and you know all different part of the world but very weak voice just few people you know mentioning those days and more than one all different uh, uh, days different date so last year we decided to make watercolor global day watercolor day or world watercolor day something real uh occasion for art world and powerful uh celebration True. and all around the world all watercolor artists celebrating following and proud each other's to congratulate watercolor day uh, all together so we choose the day which one is 23rd of january also, IWS Society and IWS Global Network start. Yes, in yes. In Turkey, one of the oldest town 
and one of the oldest history in art. 2000 years ago, artist union started also in that uh, old uh, Greek uh, historical town. This one was Teos. Yeah. And also we built uh, this society and we made the first our celebration uh international artists celebrating watercolor hmm. in uh Teo city in izmir in turkey after that all those artists who never attend those uh, festival from all different part of the world and immediately they start organizing some events in their home country under our IWS Global Network logos. Yeah, yeah. So since then, just we keep celebrating each part of the world. One of the uh, best team in India, you did great job, you Thank know, you. inviting all artists around the world and several big, very strong festival. One of them was Olympic watercolor events. Yes, yeah. yes, right. And all those uh, other our organizers also did uh, wonderful events. Yes, yes. So all together we made the watercolor something again in uh, art history. Yes, I'm sure. So, I'm sure. The youngsters are so inspired by seeing events happening all around the world and. Uh, and and also you know Atanur, today i want to tell you because this is the right time and right occasion we are again planning of uh, making the second chapter of olympia uh, in 2024 so we have already started working on that and uh, soon we will announce this we are looking for that and I yes think now this time, time i again i'm looking that more and more artists will come after this covid situation and uh, uh, many people uh, they want to come because of the covid they were just stuck there so now they are planning okay now we have to go again and we are, we will again celebrate uh, uh, like that what we did in the past actually we were very excited coming to india and all other other artists also commenting how beautiful colorful country and yes. also especially you are your team organizing events wonderful and great hospitality i think it's gonna be another big uh, highlights in watercolor history your second uh, uh international olympic and, right you know we are very excited you know celebrating second uh time uh hmm. global watercolor day hmm. and also thank you very much you are hosting this time uh with IWS India and uh, Watercolor Magazine especially. Yes, IWS many, many uh, celebrations are going on today and uh, in the different part of different states of India. And uh, you will see in our uh, footage also uh, when you will uh, see more, you know, videos, then you will see that many people are celebrating this day. And also, also we are, uh, you know, covering uh, it in our upcoming issue of the magazine. So whatever is going on on this uh, day today, so that will be covered in the upcoming issue of the IWS magazine. So everyone can see so that. So today is our celebration day and we all are celebrating. And maybe you can tell Atanur uh, about your uh, future plans, uh, what you are thinking about, uh, uh, about watercolor, because we all are working for watercolor. That is why this society you have organized and you know founded, you are the founder. So what exactly your plans are for uh, future, more uh, institutions, more cafes, what exactly you are looking? Actually, you know, it was, I never thought it is going to be that much big organization, true, uh, true. big society and more than society is like big network. That makes me excited, just not just me, is all my friends and colleagues and especially my family also excited because you know now is our lifestyle yes and, yes uh, yes watercolor you are every and, time busy you are every time busy just trying yeah. to help others and making more 
you know, uh, growth of the IWS. A whole night you are working in all the festivals. Where are you are going? You are more, you know, inclined towards making more institutes and making more people involved in this watercolor and supporting people. So, yeah. what from where you are getting that energy? <laughs> I want to ask yeah, that. This is like I told you. Our idea is never we thought that it's gonna be that much big, but it is inspiring us to make much bigger because more institution interested in joining with us. So, uh, in several years ago, we made it also some changes. Not just the society; we are a network. Exactly. And we are accepting all kind of watercolor related other art institutions. Hmm. So lots of business join us, lots of museum and some school, official university or college or some uh, you know private school also join. Hmm. And especially uh, watercolor and cafe uh, uh, colors is almost same with water based monocolors. Also, this is becoming popular and also giving another chance to us with watercolor cafe galleries growing and lots of uh, artists they like to get some support from the some kind of business mm. and art cafe is excellent ideas become yes. very popular in IWS family because uh, you know we we will have some space already opening every day and you know wall is like a galleries yes. and already uh you know cheapest material we have with coffee paint and mm. anybody can paint and you know those uh new uh materials people excited to paint and show others so we are hoping it is gonna be a really huge business those one for artists and uh you know giving service to artists Mm. And we like to coordinate those cafe galleries also within our uh, networks. That's great, so, fantastic. And many others, you know, some uh, paint company, they never produce watercolor before. All kinds yes, of paint yes. they were doing, Absolutely. especially one of them is, is like a uh, color tone in Turkey, one of the biggest and oldest paint company now. I think today, in 23rd of January, they will show their product new, very high quality watercolor paint. Hmm. And we can see lots of paper company also trying to yes. produce watercolor paint. And true, lots true, of brush true. company, you know, improving watercolor brushes. Hmm. So true. our society, our uh, network, not just, uh, you know, local one, is inspiring all kind of business art related business to uh you know bring to their knowledge and business with watercolor area and hmm. that makes our uh you know colleagues watercolor masters to find uh, better quality products and you know relation with those uh uh you know uh art producers Hmm. Uh, art material producers, art material to, produce. yeah. you know, uh, bring some good stuff in uh, our world. So That's we are fantastic. excited, and you know, and it is growing lots, and we are letting to grow more. We like to be each part of the world, each city, each corner of the world. So our colleagues, our leaders, like branch leaders also working very hard to uh, find some other uh, uh, yes, part of the, his her countries join the watercolor uh, network with their business or their uh, institutions so hmm. now we are societies with under uh, IWS uh, uh, society logos yeah many branches also we are accepting other watercolor society or art society and right. art charity charity to our network and exactly. they are keeping their identity exactly same that's they are a wonderful thing. also 
their logos and their names whenever they like to create international events and international relations they are using another logo with IWS network logos that means so you are open for collaboration many societies with uh, uh, IWS branch and also many other societies coming uh, without the branch it is uh, they are already established society uh, from the many uh, decades hmm. now they like to use our network and we are welcome yes, yes, yes. this is the network and society we never think selfish we like to connect each other and celebrate so yes. global water power day iws uh leading that yes yes true our absolutely our philosophy our big heart our family is always you know yeah. hugging every I think, uh, and, yeah. yes. and every artist that's the uh, important part people respect the iws and true true they are excited to you know collaborate and celebrate it is yes if i'm not wrong uh yeah, their the identity of under IWS. the their logos yeah the network is i think the world's biggest artist network if i'm yes. not wrong so uh, people believe us people trust us and i think in in future definitely uh, we will grow more like this and we will um, talk with other societies also and uh, definitely they will also going to join us and we will do more collaborations with them and we will grow more together. I think it has influenced the whole world, uh, everybody. And with the cafes and everything, even we have involved the general public coming to us and celebrating with us. So yeah, this, is, this is uh, such a big influence <laughs> and it shows that unity is the strength. So I think our society is the biggest uh, example of uh, unity and uh, how we are collaborating with everyone and taking the whole world together. So thank you so much for letting us know your ideas and how beautiful, uh, how beautifully you have uh, collaborated everything and uh, so excited. And I'm, I can say that I'm so proud to be a part of this yes, society. Yes, yes. Thank you so much Atanur for this session and it matters a lot and um, many people are looking today to you your views your ideas and it is really inspiring and <coughs> we are also inspired with your new ideas and definitely we will follow all those things so atanu we want to hear what's your final message for the viewers and everyone for the society members what do you want to say and i would like to thank all iws leaders and representatives and also IWS supporters, all masters, all amateur artists. Without this big family, we never can do anything. Sure, ideas is it. just ideas and nobody creates some historical stuff sure. from the ideas. But we are the family, we believe in all same things, peace, harmony and friendship and exchanging our knowledge and also exchanging our cultures without the border without the discrimination yes. that's very important that philosophy bringing all artists around the world and more and more good people join our networks Yes, definitely. True. And this Global Water Color Day, I think one of the very meaningful days because of the behind to these days, there is a huge philosophy for peace, harmony, friendship with internationally, with globally, with many different nations, many different believing, many different opinions all came together because of the arts and peace and love. So I would like to thanks again whomever joining our network and supporting this important philosophy 
and I wish futures art and artists bringing more peace and harmony around the world. That's true. And I would like to again congratulate all watercolor artists for Global Watercolor Day and Happy Watercolor Day! Happy Watercolor Thank Day! You. Yes, that's the yes. main main agenda Happy and that's the main days. slogan today happy watercolors day yes. so uh, i want to thanks you again for coming and giving us uh, that much time because i know that you are also celebrating over there and we all are yes, celebrating we are. so we uh, start celebrating many days many weeks ago you know now is yes, the yes. most important days and i am glad all different uh, time zone Yeah. Still, your creativity, you are bringing everyone together in the uh, same video. Yes, and thank yes. you very much all your effort. Thank you. Thank you, Chase. Thank, thank you, boss. Thank you, Atanul. Yeah. Okay. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. See you happy watercolor days. Bye. It was wonderful to meet Mr. Atanul Doman. Now let's go to Fremantle, Australia. and meet our friends from watercolor society of western australia let's go hi hello hi. Hello. hello happy everyone. watercolor happy day happy watercolor day <laughs> <laughs> thank you thank you so what uh, exactly you are doing in your this day you know celebrating this um, uh, watercolor day well we should probably all get together we haven't got any basic plans at home we've had an incredibly different difficult year but we're all getting together for lunch we've just had a lovely exhibition here and wow. we're all getting together for lunch to to um to celebrate that in this gallery here where there's a beautiful cafe as well it's in Fremantle in western australia and it's a gorgeous place yeah that's wonderful and what about your plans you know your future plans can you tell tell us about more about your you know uh, society. society and what exactly you are doing and what are uh, uh, how many members are there okay currently we have 140 members we're quite small but for wa that's very very good and um we had juried membership into our society so people have to present so many paintings to to get in and in the future we're going to japan and in um march to take part in the uh, in nagi iwasaki's um joint IWS and yeah. studio exhibition which we're really looking forward to and there's seven of us going there so we're really really looking forward to that and uh, we're always open to anybody who's holding exhibitions over the world to be invited to come see you as Aussies we like to travel so fantastic wherever the exhibitions are we will come to you <laughs> fantastic yeah, sorry fantastic. Okay so the aims of the Watercolor Society of Western Australia are to promote watercolor and to uh, promote our members and that's about yes. it really. Wow. <laughs> so can us can you show us a glimpse of the exhibition somebody can hold the phone and can show us uh and and maybe your it, members is it, is how it, many is it possible Uh, for you right this exhibition here well it's just come down of course because the, the next lot of people are waiting to come in so we have to flip <laughs> okay okay on facebook you'll find it everywhere on facebook and instagram it's on my instagram um i put various videos on you can see that you can say well instagram see what we got up to um, the 14 exhibition is the one that we've just had is uh 14 actually is 13 of us um we're all friends we're all actually the committee of the watercolor society of western australia and because we all get on well so, so well together and we've been, we've had a really really busy year we thought well let's put an exhibition on ourselves so that's what we've done and we've been invited to exhibit in various other places so i see we have another busy year coming up so it's been good yeah fantastic yeah. fantastic so you It can ask good. more questions if you have Uh, <laughs> Actually, we all are celebrating this, you know, wonderful day, and uh, yes, the whole uh, watercolor society. It's not about IWS, uh, you know, uh, it's about the watercolor, and 
all the artists from every part of the world is celebrating uh, this day and uh, uh, we thought that this is a very very good time to talk to you all and what exactly you are doing today yeah. in this day so uh, this is our purpose to meet you so and we uh, had a wonderful wonderful day coming to us a wonderful time yes. coming to australia and it was wonderful to see Julia, we enjoyed having you here as well and in 2024 we are going to have our third international watercolor exhibition and we're looking for people from all over the world to join us as a society or as a body not individuals so please yeah. let us know if you're interested in coming into the next one we'd love oh, it definitely, the definitely. Will be better. and uh, our best wishes are with you and for your future projects and definitely IWS members will going to join your yeah. you know exhibitions and your festival and yes. we will also invite you for our uh, next year uh, you know Olympiad. Olympiad maybe we will host in 2024 January yes. so uh, you all are invited for that and, uh, and okay you can celebrate this day with we will. more of you know we will. Thank you. More of songs. Thank you. It's been and, lovely to see you. And beautiful lunch and songs and dances. <laughs> right. And, and enjoy uh, your wonderful water, World Watercolor Day. And the same to everybody worldwide. Yeah, yeah. Thank okay, you. Okay. Same to you. And hope to see you all again. Bye bye. Sweet to you guys. Bye bye. And enjoy your bye. day. Bye bye. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, now let's take you to uh, IWS Cafe Art Gallery in Philippines where our friend Brinda is waiting. Welcome to Artists Cafe Gallery Bacolod. Today we're celebrating our Global Watercolor Day. And we are celebrating this together with the Art Association of Bacolod, sponsored by the Artist Cafe Gallery of Bacolod. With me are some famous artists like Fred Orig and uh, Tata Sevillano and the other people. And we're doing it by doing a plain air activity with Edvon Savellino, my co-leader from Negros Occidental. I am Edvon Savellino. I am a watercolorist and I started watercolor since uh, an early age. My, my mom used to buy me watercolors when I was young. And since then I was loving the, color, the, the medium and using it till now. Actually, I've been painting around 30 years and I was a member of the IWS since we started here in the Philippines. We are inviting you all, ginaimbitahan ka muna muntanan sa Global IWS members. Bisita ka mo dali sa Bacolod, sa amon nga ginatipunan, ka ginapaintingan sa plain air. Sa the ruins, you know, can see the building here, you know. So it is a very nice place to paint, you know. It's a good ambience, a good, uh, you know. Uh, Mr. Raymond uh, Abiliana, the owner, is always inviting us here and glad to be us here, you know, to paint. Hi, I'm uh, Fred Uring, a full-time artist. I practice my art uh, through in the different, uh, different uh, medium. I do sculpture, uh, painting, and mixed media. My art is uh, a way of my living, practicing almost uh, 45 years in the different medium. Ang pagiging artist ko ay ginay, ginapanumdum ko nga isa ka contribution sa bilog na kabuhi sang naga practice ang art na nagahatag sang inspiration sa ibang tao and also to my family who are also a artist Hi, I'm Anna Gwyneth Tiolo and I'm a freelancer 
I'm a mom of three, and I'm also a singer-composer of the band Kalamay Hati. I started young songwriting, and that's actually my preferred um, area of art. And I also jumped into acrylic painting just this year when I uh, wanted to do something out of my free time and make sure that I don't get depressed in the room. So I grabbed my brushes and tried painting. Do you know that this is my first time I'm doing watercolor? And it's actually allowing me to be brave because watercolor has a mind of its own. So it allows me to go out of my comfort zone. It allows me to make mistakes and be happy with those mistakes. Thank you so much for IWS and for Mr. Ed Edmon and Ma'am Brenda for inviting us over. And if you are interested in joining us, let me tell you what, it's not too late for you to learn watercolor. It's never too late for you to learn something new. So come and join us. If you want to learn more, you can visit us at IWS Art Test Cafe Gallery Facebook page. Hi, I'm Tay Sevillieno. I am a self-taught artist and I am the current president of the Art Association of Bacolod Negros, one of the longest running art groups in the Philippines. And um, I'm also a watercolorist and I've been following International Watercolor Society for a long time now, Philippines and other countries. And we are so happy that we are part of the Global Watercolor Day of the International Watercolor Society and uh, will also be a part of our activities today is to paint the ruins here in Talisay and Negros Island. Art is very important to all of us. It should be a part of our lives whether you are an artist or not. From the Negros Island, from the Philippines, I would like to greet everyone a happy Global Watercolor Day in January 2023. Thanks, Vrinda. Uh, okay, let's move to uh, Hemkanti Art Gallery in Nepal and let's see what they are doing.
let's meet Masa from Iran. She is the owner of Maha Art Gallery. This is Mahsa Mehdizadeh, owner of IWS Mah Art Gallery. I would like to say hello to IWS Big Family and also congratulate the 11th Foundation of IWS Globe Art Nerd Network as well as a Watercolor Global Day. We are glad to have celebrated this day in IWS Mah Art Gallery holding a workshop with great Iranian masters and artists. Indeed, I'd like to appreciate Mr. Atanur Dugan for the establishment and management of this big family and also the IWS board members for their constant support and efforts during all these years. So now let's go to Japan where our friend Iwa Sakanagi is waiting. <laughs> Happy World War Day, okay. my friends. Welcome to the Yosaki Nagi. The world is here. Thank you very much. Today, I'm going to show you how to do this. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. ちょっと作ったもんですよ。ね、ちゃんと。これを半分にしてもいい。ね、大丈夫かいって言ったかな。半分に。あれ、うんこ。どっちで。じゃあ、ちゃんと。じゃあ、ちゃんと。じゃあ
Hello everybody, my name is Anastasia and I am a member of International Watercolor Society Glock Young as well as a member of International Watercolor Society Bulgaria. I am recording this video for the International Watercolor Day on January 23rd and I would like to congratulate you with this as well as with a Happy New Year 2023. I'm currently visiting the Netherlands at the moment, so I took some pictures of Amsterdam and decided to make a painting for this day and for you too. So that is it. I hope you like it. Although I didn't bring any of my art supplies in my trip, so I had to rush uh, different shops and buy uh, and I bought five colors and some other supplies. So it helped me to make this painting come true. Again, I hope you like it. So uh, thank you so much for your attention. Thanks for watching this video and. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Happy watercolor. Happy Global Watercolor Day from Azerbaijan. Happy birthday, IWS from Azerbaijan. Okay, let's go to Russia, Moscow, where our friend Sarah is waiting for us. And also, we will see the demonstrations of Nikolai and Ilya and Rai, the masters. Hello, my dear friends. This is Sarah Mohedian, IWS School of Manager. I'm very happy that we're here. The first I congratulate the Global Watercolor Day and even IWS um, anniversary to all members and all large family, especially all President Mr. Atan Oduran, who created this wonderful opportunity for all of us. And especially thank my dear friends, their Amit and Mera for their hard work and um, organizing this great event. Hope to see you all next year and celebrate together this special day. Happy Global Watercolor Day! Дорогие друзья и коллеги, поздравляю вас с Новым Годом и с этим прекрасным покорением событий. Желаю в Новом Году вам тепла, добра, любви, гармонии и творческого вдохновения на каждый день. А это от меня небольшой сюрприз в скетч. До встречи! Пока-пока!
nurturance of happiness and uphold the law of love. Oh, how let's singing with the chords, our brushes dancing with the pain. In the water we meet in harmony, that makes our masterpiece. For the warmth and cheer and love we spread From the bad times we stay clear Immortalizing what we hold dear What we hold and dear Sprinkle 
enjoyed the demonstrations of Nikolai and Ilya. Uh, now we have some uh, wonderful celebrations and uh, some wishes from all our artist friends. And also, also, also from our master artist Andy Everson from USA and Cesc Ferre, my dear friend from Spain. So let's see. Hi everyone, Andy Evenson here, wishing you a happy Global Watercolor Day from snowy Minnesota up here in the northern US. Um, this is by far my favorite time of year up here. I'm kind of an oddball in that regard. Uh, most people up here are sick of winter after a couple weeks and are looking for a way to escape it and fly somewhere south, but um, I just get so inspired uh, when I walk out the door and see the, that world all covered in a blanket of snow. Um, so I, I really look forward to this time of year and um, not only just the snow paintings and the scenery that it, it provides me but um, it's also a good time of year for me to finally kind of slow down. Uh, my schedule is awfully hectic for the majority of the year between you know um, traveling for exhibitions and traveling to teach workshops and um, you know those windows when the weather's nice up here I like to get outside as much as I can and, and plein air paint and, and kind of hone those skills I don't get a, a, a large opportunity to do that up here uh, the weather is not really conducive for plein air painting and watercolor not only when it's cold like this in the winter time but our summers are awfully hot and humid and spring is really super windy so um, it's always a challenge uh, for plein air painting but um, I said as much as I enjoy doing it and it's you know the best way to learn painting from life um, I do really look forward to this time of year when it provides me that window to just kind of slow down and um, look at some of the old paintings that I've done earlier in the year and decide which ones I might want to work up into larger studio paintings uh, but most of all paint what really inspires me the most and um, this season up here winter is um, by far the most inspiring for me I look forward to it every year so I've been having a great time and I hope you all find something that inspires you greatly in uh, the coming year and wish you all a happy watercolor day. Like I said, enjoy yourselves. Bye. Hello everyone. Have a nice new year and with this short video I would like to give my support at the Global Watercolor Day. That day will be the next 23 January. I hope you enjoy it. Have a nice day and all the best from Spain. Adios amigos. Hi folks, this is a special celebration day and I want to introduce uh, Diana, my partner and my wife here to meet you and uh, to be able to share with me some of the beautiful moments that we can share. Thank you David for that lovely introduction. Now I've been thinking about what I can say that's been important to me on my journey and I'd have to say it's play, it's having fun because when we have fun we bring in creativity, we bring in our intuition and we bring in our feelings which are all the most important part of any artistic journey. So just think about what gives you joy. What gives you joy? It might be landscape, it might be abstraction, it might be plain air, it might be music. So just leave that with you and I have to say it has been the most amazing thing that has helped me. Play, find the magic in play. Aren't we lucky to share this beautiful vision of watercolour together on this special day? I think it's so magic to go out and paint from nature to actually share those moments of uh, happiness through your eyes, through your heart, through the actual senses, and to be able to capture that moment forever. And I think, to me, that's uh, something that I see a lot of families doing now. Uh, they say one in five paint, but uh, you know, nature's a great teacher. And uh, I'd share that with you forever. Uh, I can always remember experiences myself growing up uh, where things didn't turn out well and uh, I can always remember uh, throwing a painting in a room, tossing a bucket of water on it and guess what, 
came back three hours later and it was fantastic. <laughs> so, you know, the magic of atmosphere is so special. We're painting watercolour with water that's created in our atmosphere. How magic is that? So we share this around the world today, a special day, and I am so happy to share this information from my heart to you all. And I hope everyone benefits from sharing a little bit of nature, going out, enjoying the experience. So thank you for being with us today and I hope your life is so special from trying this. Uh, if you haven't gone out, don't just paint from your iPad. If you haven't gone out, take that time to paint from life. And remember, the very first thing I did when I saw that magic moment was, oh, I was so excited, I jumped. And so remember, jump. Thank you. Hello friends, I'm Kasper Sen from IWS Bangladesh. Today is our 11th anniversary of IWS Global Watercolor Days. I congratulate all from IWS Bangladesh. Happy 11th anniversary of IWS Global Watercolor Day from IWS Bangladesh. Hello guys, I'm from Bangladesh. Happy anniversary of IWS from Bangladesh Global Watercolor Day. Happy 11th anniversary of IWS Global Watercolor Day, IWS Bangladesh. Okay, now let's see how our Indian artists are celebrating Global Watercolor Day. This is a Delhi Police Public School in New Delhi, capital of India. So, uh, Ravinder sir, please can you give some message or you want to say something about this day? First of all, uh, I would like to convey my best wishes. Uh, on the World Watercolor Day to the whole fraternity of artists. And secondly, nowadays uh, we are too much uh, working on watercolors. And uh, in a complete world, a kind of a new wave is there for watercolor. And in fact, the, I do, I am working with all these young budding artists and they are also really loving watercolor. So uh, I feel uh, coming future of at least uh, in a world for watercolors is tremendous so once again happy watercolors day thank you so they all are the student of delhi police public school and they all are celebrating this global watercolor day and uh, uh, you can see uh, the awards of this school right and a wonderful beautiful classroom and in this art room they all are celebrating and Ravinderji is a judge of the watercolor competition poster competition on this day so once again you can thank you everyone and see you again hi all this is Anand Srinivasan IWS Coordinator Karnataka. I wish you all a very happy Global Watercolor Day. We had organized watercolor painting in Delhi Public School Bangalore East with the children there and they had a very good time and it was a pleasure to celebrate Global Watercolor Day 
by doing art with watercolors. Do you enjoy the art class? Yes! Do you enjoy painting in watercolors? Yes! gathered here to celebrate International Watercolor Day and uh, myself Kalida Satardekar, I am heading uh, Goa uh, coordinator IWS and uh, my team is here, uh, they are doing plain air over here and uh, we are uh, at the famous uh, old Goa church, very famous uh, nationally and internationally. So we are here, my team is also doing plain air, now uh, we can see them uh, doing uh, plain air painting. Thank you so much. Yeah, he is an art teacher. Hi, hi. Neha Matodkar, hi. hello. Hi, hi. Kabir sir, hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Anita madam, say hi. Hi. Smita. Hi sir. Oh, Kashandi madam. Hi sir. Uh, today we are doing the previous session of the beautiful church called the Goa Church. Hi, Kalidas. Enjoying the plain air watercolor. Hello, Prasad. Hi. Hello, Sachin. Hi, sir. Hello. He's a lawyer. He's a lawyer. Hello, Shailesh. Hello, I'm Advocate Shailesh uh, Vengulekar here. And uh, in celebration of International Watercolor Event, we are here uh, for a plain air uh, event to paint uh, the, this beautiful church. Hi. Hello, Lina. Hi. Hello, Govind sir. Hello. Hi. Happy Watercolor International Day. Tomitra. Hi. Hello. Hello. Happy International Watercolor Day. Hello, sir. How are you? I'm uh, doing good plan here on uh, Old Goa for uh, church. Oh, be nice, sir. Hello. Hi. Good evening, everyone. We are celebrating the International Watercolor Day, and this is the amazing Basilica of Mount Jesus.
my name is mopa singh wal i would like to wish all success on this auspicious occasion of the world global watercolor day thank you hi everybody i am prasant kirpi from kerala an artist and traveler on this special day january 23 the global watercolor day i wish you a wonderful watercolor day to you all thank you so much namaste i am artist raj balram from kanno kerala i am presently staying in alwar 23 january is a world global watercolor day so i wish all my artist friends a great global watercolor day thank you Hi friends, this is Anil here from Kerala. I am a watercolor artist. 23rd of Jan is considered to be the global watercolor day. I wish you all a very successful future in watercolor on this auspicious day. Thank you. Happy global watercolor day to all the watercolor enthusiasts and artists. As we celebrate the global watercolor day on Jan 23rd. Thank you. Everyone, good morning. I am Shabri Girish, Kerala. This January 23 we are celebrating global water color so we are wishing you happy global water color happy global water color day so today we are celebrating the 20th or 23rd of January the global water color day and uh, uh, you know all my students are here and many many more artists are there inside uh, we will show you later on that footage also uh, demonstrations are going on and you can see there maybe you can take the camera that side you can see the exhibition is going on already and uh, beautiful exhibition is going on on this occasion of 23rd january we are all celebrating here with my students Madam is there, Mega Ji is there, and all all our you know friends, students, and all our artists are there. They all are inside, and we will show you soon that also. Okay, take care. Bye bye once again, everyone. Global Water Color Day. Megha Kapoor, uh, the editor of the International Watercolor Society magazine, and this is my team wishing you happy, happy global, global watercolor day. day. I hope you enjoy our global watercolor day celebration uh, in our Asian zone. And now let's take you to Zahare, who's uh, hosting the Iran zone and some parts of Europe. 